So I designed the commission project really to show the audience what happens in the process of a commission work. So I know a lot of us have gone to concerts and, and seen in the program that this new work today has been commissioned by us and today we're gonna to perform the world premiere. And I think that's great. We all, you know, we're doing this as well. Let's come and see the concert. But I think we lose where the magic really is. We don't get to see where, what happens in this process. And I think it's very interesting what does happen in this process and the audience misses out on it. So I decided to show the audience in such a way uh, what the composers are going through. Uh, when their composers are finished and they send the musicians to work, what we go through as musicians. And this is where it gets really interesting is we do the feedback between, okay, we call the composers up, we have this interaction going on between composer and the musicians, that this is working, this isn't working. Um, so we, there's this editing process that kind of cycles around before you hear the concert. And then we, you know, we finally find something that actually fits together. And then it works beautifully. And uh, that's what you hear at the end of the concert. So to do this, we're going to be doing video blogs. The composers are doing, I think, three, three video blogs. And um, then we'll get, the, we'll get the pieces, and we'll do video blogs of our rehearsals and video blogs of, of us corresponding with the composers. So it's going to be a very exciting project, and you guys will all get to interact with this before you hear the concert in November. So, yeah, so Greg Gummersall actually became a part of the, the project um, almost a week and a half after the first commission project happened last season. Um, I was reviewing the tape and I was watching the concert and uh, kind of marinated on a little bit and come to the conclusion that something was actually missing from the concert. Uh, and after a while I decided that something visually needed to be uh, shown at the concert. And I thought it would be a wonderful idea to put visual art as the inspiration for the composers to write their works. And so, lo and behold, I had actually just met this wonderful artist uh, the year before. And so I actually called him up and I said, Mr. Gummersall, how would you like, would you be interested in painting six original canvases for composers to use as inspiration for six original compositions that they're going to write? And automatically, Greg loved the idea, thought it would be wonderful. And... That's how Greg got a part of the, uh, the commission project. I think Greg's works actually are perfect to set to music. They, they are musical in themselves. Um, they have a nice, well, they're well structured. They have a nice balance. And what I think really does work musically is that the multitude of textures and the clarity of textures that Greg uses without so much clutter going on in the painting itself. And then still, with all these mechanics going on, there's a nice expressionistic line that you get to see in the painting as well. So this is, I think these are perfect, perfect characteristics to be set to uh, a brand new work. 